Hi, I'm Chef Alex Burry, and today we're going to learn how to chop an onion the easy and quick way. Knowing how to cut a vegetable quickly will help you eat healthier food. We all go to the farmer's market or the store all the time, buy a whole bunch of vegetables, and then we never prep them and they end up going rotten. So here's a couple quick tips. So first, when you get your onion, cut it in half. Because when you have a whole onion, it's gonna roll around and that's gonna make it unstable and you can cut yourself. So cut, whether it's a potato, a carrot, an onion, cut it in half so you have a flat, stable surface. Next, take off the outer skin and take off a lot of it. Because if you think about an onion, you know it has those thin layers in between and that can cause your knife to slip and cut you. So don't chance, take off all that outer onion. Make sure all the peeling is off your cutting board. Cut off the tip. So the root end, which is the hairy end, you're gonna leave that part intact. Now you want a very sharp knife. And oddly enough, the sharper your knife is, the safer it is. A dull knife is more likely to bounce off the onion and it could bounce onto your finger and cut you. So get a good sharp knife and you're gonna use your finger to guide it back. Not your fingertip, but your knuckle. So if I move back quickly, it's gonna be wider slices. If I go back slowly, it'll be thin. So again, it's flat and stable. The root is attached. And you've got a nice sharp knife. And you're gonna cut through. Now, it's still attached at the root. You can see that. So now you turn it around. And you have a nice, quick, even, perfect dice. And you can do big pieces, if you're making a hearty stew, or you can do little, little tiny pieces if you're making a um, more delicate sauce. And there you go. And that works for carrots, potatoes, any other hard, round vegetable. There we go. And now I'm all ready for a delicious super stew. And that is how you chop an onion. This is a skill that every vegan should know, or even if you're just starting to eat more plant-based meals, this will help you save time in the kitchen.